Blue Angel Diamond is rolling. As they pass before you, you'll notice that the smoke is not visible while the engines are an afterburner. Experience four times the full of gravity required to round out the backside of this looping maneuver. Here comes one. I don't know how many G's that is. It's like 40. <laughs> Back to the right. Blue Angel number five is rolling. He'll accelerate to 170 miles per hour and roll his aircraft 360 degrees immediately after takeoff. The dirty roll on takeoff. separation that exists between these four aircraft. From the right, the Blue Angel Diamond. Two 
solo pilots are approaching once again, this time to demonstrate the inverted flight capabilities of the F-A-18. Approaching inverted from the left and right, they'll roll the aircraft 360 degrees, crossing over center point, the opposing inverted to inverted roll. Flat pass. Five and six are approaching the flight line in a line of breast formation at 400 miles per hour. Crossing center point, they'll roll the aircraft 270 degrees and cross with minimum separation as they commence the opposing minimum radius turn.
setting up for their next maneuver. Bruins go five and six are converging on center point to demonstrate the rapid roll rate of the F-18 fly by wire flight control system. Crossing center point, they'll complete two consecutive rolls. Totaling 720 degrees with a closure rate of over 800 miles per hour. Ladies and gentlemen, the opposing horizontal roll. Coming down for each The Blue Angel, left echelon roll. Based in Pensacola, Florida, completed an intensive winter training period at the Naval Air Facility El Centro, California. Once again, the beautiful weather of the Imperial Valley provide us with the optimum conditions to fly each of the demonstration pilots on the 120 training flights necessary prior to our first public demonstration. Our show season opened on the 15th of March and runs continuously each weekend through mid-November. The Blue Angels will perform 70 flight demonstrations this season while visiting 34 cities throughout the United States and Canada. Oh, I wanted to hit the bird. Shuck up the bird. <laughs> Difficult maneuver. Lieutenant Commander Darren will experience four times the roll rate generated by Commander Barlow's aircraft. The Blue Angel left echelon roll. Let's watch as the three wingmen smoothly shift back into the Blue Angel Diamond. Diamond to the right. By looking 
90 degrees from their flight path towards Commander Bartlett's aircraft. From the right, at 350 miles per hour, the line of breath flat pass. Commanding 32,000 pounds of thrust to demonstrate the additional climb and acceleration capabilities of the F-18. From the right, the section, high off the pass. Each pile will roll his aircraft 270 degrees in ripple fashion, take separation, and rejoin Commander Bartlett in the diamond formation.
back to the right. Aren't you so about they're making their approach to the flight line, but in a slightly different formation. If you look closely, you'll see that both aircraft are upside down. Approaching center point, they'll roll their aircraft 270 degrees in section. The double tuck over roll. Whether it be a tactical jet, a propeller-driven aircraft, or one of our helicopters, each requires skill which the naval aviator must master. In order to perfect this skill, naval marine pilots spend a great deal of time in the landing pattern, practicing carrier approaches. Very shortly, Commander Barlett and all the demonstration pilots will be performing a carrier approach. Approaching the runway from the right, Commander Barlett is confirming that the landing checks have been completed, and in fact, each aircraft is ready to land. <laughs> Rolling out on final, they'll make one last check of the crosswind, one last line of correction, and adjust their power to maintain the optimum rate of descent for the proper touchdown point. Six demonstration pilots you've been watching perform here this afternoon are but a small part of the Blue Angel team.